Well, a stiff challenge for a couple of hockey teams tonight from the BBC Center down here in Florida. A couple of teams desperate for victories. The Blackhawks have had two wins in their last 13 starts. The Florida Panthers are coming off a road trip of six games that did not go well for them. We told you a moment ago, the last two times they've played, they've already been trailing. So maybe we could call it a moral victory. Here's Yandel going across the one time and they score! Hoffman! Mike Hoffman! A bullet! And a power play tally gives Florida the lead. Now Forsling for Gustafson. The 100th NHL game for Eric Gustafson tonight. He had a really tough night last night in Tampa. That dash three will tell you that. Here's a chance for McCann right to the goal. What a play! Jared McCann pulled it to the backhand and put it right up under the bar. Great goal. And now it's 2-0. into the zone, trying to beat a check. He did right to the goal, can't be scored! What a play! He walked around Aaron Ekblad like he was standing still. And he's able to score in the first minute of period two. Camp cuts the lead in half. Wow, what a play by David Camp. Looks like a 40 or 50 point man on that play. Beautiful move. Forsling. His side into the zone. Brandon side around Matheson, centered it. They score! Patrick Kane, a neat tip. That play made beautifully by Brandon Sada. Backhand pass right into the wheelhouse of Kane and tipped it. This game is tied. Now the draw to the Panthers. To the corner taken by Hoff, and he put it across in a shot. They score! Aaron Ekblad jumped in. A perfect feed from Mike Hoffman, and Ekblad buried it. Now it's the Panthers back in front. Let it take advantage of some tired visitors. Seabrook chasing it down. Gave it away. Here's Bukestad in front. Huberto, the tip, they score! And Vetrano, who took the penalty, winds up scoring the goal. The Hawks, same five guys were out for the whole two minutes. Then they had to defend. It's in the back of the net. Bukestad turned it over. Here's a chance for 410 right to the goal to the forehand. It does go in. That might have been kicked in by the Panther player, but 410 able to get credit for a short-handed goal of the Blackhawks midway in the third. Back in it. As both Bukestad and Fortan come to the front of the net, a skate propels this puck in. Boy, can't tell if there's any distinct kicking motion or not there, Pat. After reviewing the play, the call the ice stand, we have a good goal. Cleared in behind by Brower, Hawks are there, and Yoki Haru flipped it ahead to Tay. John Hayden gets the line. Got a bull's way to the net. Sad. No goal is the call. The red light went on. Saad thought it was in. Now it's frozen. Brandon Saad raised his arms. He thought it was in. The call on the ice right away was no goal. So we'll be able to look back and see what happened there. Oh, the Hawks that close to tying the game, but they're still down one late in the third. Seabrook in deep. It's cleared around the board to Kane with five. Goes down low. Saad centered to bring in a shot. He scores! Point eight left! How did that go in? Alex to bring it didn't get a lot on the shot. It goes right in the middle of the net. And with less than a second remaining, we're tied. Alex to bring it gets this puck to the net and it takes a crazy care of. It's like a pinball machine in front of the net. What a play by Brandon Saad. Two defensemen below. It goes off the stick and maybe the hand of Barkov, and it finds its way between the wickets. Camp won a draw. Gustafson has room. Cuts to the middle of the shot. He scores! Eric Gustafson off a of David Camp faceoff win. Hawks win it in overtime. They have never led in the game till this moment. 
What a comeback. And Schmaltz with a little shovel pass as Gustafson looks like he's going outside, cuts back to the inside, and wow, they needed this one in a big, big way. And the Hawks, who have not won a road game since then, that's eight in a row before tonight without a victory away from home. What an uplifting come from behind victory to end off what had been a frustrating week. So the Hawks moved it within one game of the 500 mark with a scintillating come from behind victory tonight.